Now, a few weeks ago, we did a video on the channel about a country that has caught my eye. And we dove into the pregame meditator and decided why this country is producing ridiculous regens at such a cheap cost. We looked at the fact that Colombia has more clubs that have hidden higher attributes in what helps produce the world's best regens other than countries such as Brazil, Argentina, Italy, and even Germany. But a lot of people wanted to see more like this, so we're going to put our mathematical minds to the test and see what really is statistically the best countries to look for regens. So there are four different attributes that we're going to be taking into consideration that a club has to have to help develop regen or new gen wonder kids in the game. These are youth coaching, youth recruitment, youth facilities and youth importance. You also had to take in consideration the nation that these clubs are from and the nation that the clubs are producing the regens from's youth rating out of 200. For instance, Brazil and Germany are at the top, whereas other countries which are less likely to produce the world's best players are down the bottom. So it makes sense that some of the clubs, even though they have all of these things, aren't producing the best players because they're producing the best players of that nation, not of the world. So let's start with something basic to ease us in. There are 45 clubs that have a rating of 16 out of 20 or above in all four club attributes that we mentioned earlier in the pre-game editor, including four teams from the Netherlands and five from Spain. Now, outside of the regular teams that you expect to see on this list and some of the center of excellence schools dotted around, including Australia, for instance, we have a few smaller teams here to highlight. First off, we have FC Punic of Armenia. We have Club Depor Universidad Católica of Chile. Libertad of Paraguay and Vitoral or Vitoral Constanta of Romania. However, yet again, none of these countries have a youth rating of 100 out of 200 for that nation, which is actually quite mental because when you have a look at youth rating, countries like Iran, Iraq, and Jordan have youth ratings of 105, 106, and 107. In fact, Australia and Paraguay only has a youth rating of 90, Romania, 91, Chile, 93, and Armenia is unfortunately all the way down at 43. So although these clubs might still be worth looking at if you do have them loaded because it's it's potentially good to find young, cheap players. It's probably unlikely that you're going to find a world-class player at these clubs, possibly players that you can flip for profits, however, so I do still implore you to go take a look. So I decided to switch things up a little bit on the club section and look at clubs that have 16 for youth coaching or youth facilities, so one of the other, that still has at least 16 out of 24 youth recruitment and youth importance. And in this filter, as you can see, there was 81 clubs. Clubs such as Cape Town Spurs, IA from Iceland, k from Kazakhstan, and Club Independiente de Valle. Again, all clubs that you can take a look at which have players worth stealing for a cheap cost. But again, the highest nation youth rating is 95, and that is South Africa. So probably not world class. So enough messing around now. Statistically, where should you be looking for the best players on the game? Now, Brazil, they have the highest youth rating, like I mentioned, of 163 of all the nations in the world out of 200, which makes me wonder why you even have a 200 if your highest is going to be 163. But still, the clubs don't have the best attributes and a lot of you wanted to see a more EU-based look, a more European-based for your clubs. Germany have the second highest, however, with 155 out of 200 on Italy and France in the 140s behind them. Again, not really surprising. However, I feel like the first real surprise is Egypt, and they have a rating of 138 youth rating, which weirdly is higher than the Netherlands, Portugal and England. Turkey is also higher as well than those three nations, but the clubs let both of these nations down. Turkey does have some good clubs, however, just nowhere near as many as those other nations, so it's, it kind of cancels itself out. However, Serbia for me is definitely up there as one of the top three places to scout. They have two clubs in Red Star and Partizan that have 16 or above for all four club attributes 
and Serbia itself has a nation youth rating of exactly 100 out of 200. Now, although the bigger, well-known nations always produce the good players, club-wise, who stands out if we set all of the club attributes to 17? Only two nations have more than one club. Smaller clubs still include Vitoral or Vitoral, still don't know how to say it, Maccabi Tel Aviv and Invigado from Colombia, who we also seen in the last video. But statistically, the second best place to scout is Portugal. They have two clubs in Sporting and Benfica, two clubs that you probably already know about, that have a nation youth rating of 114. And the number one spot on the list as the best nation that statistically you should be looking for for regens is the Netherlands. A youth rating of 122 with four clubs that have 17 or more in all four club attributes. Those being Ajax, PSV, Feyenoord and AZ Alkmaar, the four that you kind of would expect. But maybe you expected it, maybe you didn't. Is there a country that you like to go for your regens? This is just statistically what I have found. Let me know down in the comments and I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.